Daily Vegan News, the 22nd of December. And I have a correction from yesterday's news. Yesterday wasn't the 22nd, it was the 21st. I apologize sincerely. Pumpkin seeds, some cool basil. I hope it's basil. Dr. Gregor with a new video about how green tea can prevent cancer. I really, really hope that he will, at the end, as always, say that whole food, plant-based, is you can do that without drinking the green tea. Because I don't drink green tea, and I don't think you need to drink green tea to prevent cancer. You get all the antioxidants anyway from all the whole food, plant-based stuff you eat, like greens and beans and other green vegetables and colorful vegetables, red peppers, blue, <laughs> there's no blue peppers, only <laughs> red, green and yellow, yeah. And other types, you know, there's so much food, C cool food. I, I, didn't, I didn't know about taro uh, until I went to Lao, but they also have Lao here, in t um, ah, they also have taro here, so the, the, the whole food plant-based there are so many different foods to to experiment with and to try that you will there are so many different types of plant foods that you wouldn't if you tried one each day you wouldn't be able to try all of them if you tried a new one every day for the, your entire life except if we are so stupid of a human motherfucking race that we will destroy all plants and there will be only one plant left or like thousand plants left then we will manage it if we are so brain damaged that we will destroy the planet but that's the way it goes in the u.s up to nearly one in three men in their 30s already have small prostate cancers brewing in japan men die with their tumors rather than from their tumors well if you have men drink six cups of green tea a day before undergoing prostate removal surgery, they can indeed build up that 40 picomole cancer-stopping concentration in their prostate tissue. That may explain why some studies failed to find an association between tea drinking and cancer. In the U.S., for example, the high tea drinking group may be defined as more than five cups of tea a week, which didn't seem to do much, but in Japan the high tea drinking group can be five more cups a day, which appeared to cut the risk of aggressive prostate cancer about in half. So Dr. Greger actually talks about that the diet can be in the, the reason why people get the cancer, but this video is actually about people already having prostate cancer, if it, that can be stopped or slowed or actually just have a tumor but it will not be to any danger for your body so the diet will probably cause the the tumors in the first place and you could actually try to stop and slow it for uh, already cancer patients in the prostate with green tea high concentrations of green tea that means around five cups of green tea per day today i found a big piece of plastic the garden. Any vegan news? Send them my way!